Hello, hello, welcome to the next episode of Final Fantasy VIII, No Junction slash No Leveling Challenge Run. We are about to do the forced encounters in Galbadia. Not Galbadia, Dalit, whatever you want to call it. Obviously, we need to kill off Spall and Zell. We need Cypher to absorb all the experience. As long as... Sorry, um... As long as we don't fight any battles, Cypher should not gain any levels by the time you beat the snake, since the snake is the last encounter, forced encounter. Please keep in mind this is my first time doing this run. I probably should have started off with an easier run, but what the hell, I'm, I like to punish myself if you haven't seen my YouTube videos already. <laughs> I will be skipping all the text and stuff. I'm including all the force encounters. So that's all the Galbadian soldiers and the big snack. And that will be the last of it. Alright, that's force encounter number one. I mean, it's pretty obvious how to beat them all, right? I mean, just use the. use the... Um, I can't talk today. You know how to do it. There we go. No mercy. Oh yeah, before you do the final fight with the snake and stuff, make sure that Cypher is healed up if he's low on HP, because the snake will have a chance to crit you for like 158 damage, and he's like a tanky snake too, so it's basically just going to be a limit break fight. Forced encounter. One more left in this area. Alright, now we want to get a hundred spirit on our test, so what you want to do is try, try not to get any forced encounters. I mean, we can cheat and use the forced encounter thing, cheat, since we're playing the remastered version, but 
Let's not cheat. <laughs> anyway, I'm um, just three encounters or less. So. I mean, the guy that I'm following says he can. It's allowed, even though it says to only get one. So I'm trusting the guide. <laughs> Even though I am following a guide, some things I'm going to do differently in this run. Hopefully it won't end up screwing up the run, but we shall see. Start reading. Uh, we'll start the readings in the next video, or once all the mission is done. <laughs> this is the only thing that's stressing me out right now is getting all the requirements for the test scores. Anyway, come on, come on! I got things to do here. If you walk, you're less likely to get an encounter. I mean, odds are I will probably get one, but we'll make it past halfway through the bridge before we get an encounter. Nice. Now we're just going to run the rest of the way. Last force encounter. This Cypher is a little low on HP, as I said, just heal him. The snake can be tricky. He hits for like 76 damage. If he crits you, it's 158, so. Yeah, here we go. No, I'm sorry, yeah, he always hits the first turn, so. As long as he doesn't crit me. Oh, wow, 68. He's a fast boy, so hopefully we can end it before he kills us. We have to use limit break, by the way. <laughs> He only hits for like 88 damage, so this is the only way we're gonna end him fast. I do not know how much HP he has, but I'm guessing probably around a thousand, maybe. All right, well we're getting close to dying here. Hopefully he does not crit us. If he crits us, we're screwed. Six hundred damage. He will squeeze us at some point. Or dark mist us, hopefully he doesn't do that. So 
me when I tell you that he's a tanky snake. So far, she has not crit us, which is good. And there we go, guys. That is the forced encounters for a gullet mission. I'll see you for the next episode when we fight Biggs and Wedge and Alvaret, whatever his name is. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video hit the like subscribe button whatever you feel like doing but yeah take care guys see you on the next one